Now then, lads. It's been a while now, about three years since I've done an upload. So, uh, today I'm going to be doing a book review, yeah? I've just finished this book maybe a few days ago. Brilliant book. Really, really enjoyed this. Warrior of the Wild by Tricia Levenseller. Great book. A lot of expansive creativity in her writing from start to finish. A really entwining no novel <coughs> entertaining the idea of a woman on a trial who was in love with a man and that man's betrayed her and now she's lost everything and got banished and worked her way to the very top and then banished him. Should have, uh, should have said there was a few spoilers about the book. But, it's a, it's a fiction book, and, oh, what would it be, what genre? Action and adventure, but it's not Norse mythology, it's more of a, as Tricia Levenseller says in the, what, what do you call this? We're just going to say the glossary, yeah? The glossary, the glossary. <clears throat> she says that it's more of a, a book based on axe fighting, whereas her previous novels are based on sword fighting. So this is a very different twist. As you can see, this is the axe that is perfectly described, and this is what it would look like if I was to picture it in my head. This is some of the scenery we would see. The wild is... Uh, it's the place outside of all the villages in this little fictional world you see and a lot of it is undiscovered making the wild wild and look at this just look at some of the thorns look at how dangerous it looks it looks quite scary and there's a lot of there's a lot of that in the book about overcoming your fears and just trying to build yourself up to be more confident be a better person leadership Lots of different, uh, what do you call them now? What are the bloody things? What are they? <laughs> oh dear. Shit. Not morals. Is it morals? Themes. I don't know. I can't remember what I was on about now. The wild. Something about the wild. And whilst reading this book, I had some of this to drink. A reduced strawberry orange and apple, shake me well, little drink. It's a high pressure processed orange and apple juice with strawberry puree. Fucking banging stuff. And my next book I'm going to read is The Underground Railroad. Winner of the Pulitzer Prize for Fiction in 2017. Now this, I've gone to a charity shop for a quid. For a bloody quid this book cost me. That cost me, what, ten quid? Can go to a charity shop, just snap them up like that. So, can I do a review of this next? And, uh, hope you enjoyed this book review once again. Uh, it's the second coming. Yeah. You heard it here first. 25th of 12, 22 is today.